Hello everyone, welcome to Art with Joshi and I am your mentor Shikha. Today we will create a very interesting painting. That's achromatic painting. You'll ask me what is achromatic painting? Achromatic painting is a painting which we work in only black and white and it's basically the shades of grey, black and white which makes this painting as achromatic painting. So let's start. Before we start, I would request you all to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for all the latest updates. So the material required is a paper, pencil, I'm using black and white poster colors, brushes, mixing palette and some clear water. And of course, don't forget the rough cloth that is also very important so let's start i also want to tell you about our new art channel that is lux on the trail if you want to see uh, all the travel videos fun musti just subscribe the channel so let's start with it uh, now for this achromatic painting, what we can do is we can create any design, any pattern. So what I'm doing is from the middle of the page, I will be making some mountains. So I'm making a landscape. I'm making some mountains here. And just like that, some simple few lines here I'll make a sun you can take I'm making some leaves and plants coming up just random drawing you can take any landscape, you can make any landscape of your choice. Now from here, we have a lot of empty space, so I'm making some plants. So this is the foreground. And this is the background. We will create the whole thing in just black shades of black and white. I'm creating some more plants around. So anything you can create. It's a very simple drawing. Now what we'll do is, on this simple drawing, we will color everything with the shades of grey. So mixing palette is very important. Now we have to make so many shades of grey or uh, black by using black and white so that every part is different. So let's make... a. Uh, We'll first create, take out your white color in your palette and we'll keep mixing the colors. I'm taking the white color. For the black color, the only thing is please use pinch of it. Don't use a lot of together. Keep using a pinch of it so that we can keep changing the colors. Now, if you have to do a big area, make makes the color all together. I don't want you to make little color and then you mess up working with it. For the bigger areas, you will always use a big brush to color. For the smaller areas, you can always use a smaller brush. It's a very interesting topic. So I have created a random grey color and I'll start with the mountains. Okay. 
I'll be doing two different colors in both the mountings. Mix the color well and start with the painting. Now what I'll do is, I'll because this one is at the back side, I'll add little more black. I'm adding little more black color. So we'll keep changing the color. It's quite similar. So we'll add more of black. We'll directly not we'll not use directly the black color. We have to just add wipe your brush every time. Now we have two different shades. We can use them at different places also. Now I'm taking this color a little bit in my palette and we'll add some more white color to it to make it a lighter tone. Now this one again I'm using the little darker tone. Just keep diluting the paint in it and you will get different shades. Every time you do that you will get a different shade. Just check in case you feel it's... See. Can you see the difference? What I have done is I have added the white color in just this color. So you can see the difference. Do the work patiently, don't be in a hurry to finish it. I keep telling you this because when we are doing the painting, I want you to enjoy the process. So, you know, we have seen so many of black and white uh, photographs of the older times. So everything is demarcated and it's in the different uh, shade. So this painting is just on that concept where we will be making each and everything but with a different shade but the only thing is we will be using only and only the black and white color and the tones of grey Now I'll add more of white to it to make it a much lighter tone for the sky so that there is a vast difference you can always check it I think I want much lighter than this shade now this is a bigger area so I can take a bigger brush to paint Now I am painting on this because I am planning to make it much darker. 
so with the dark color we'll use so I'm just overlapping it now paints have this benefit that we can always use the other color when once it's dry we we'll let it dry and once it's dry we can use the other color to make these petals so this will have more finishing we could have done it this way also so it's our choice how you do it again I'm using the other brush and I have this color the dark one now this area is almost dry so I'm starting from this part you need to wait till your uh, area is dry otherwise you can tend to spoil the things Now we'll use the same thing. This area is dry. So Now here again we can take the different shades, we can mix the shade and create a shade to give it a lighter tone. Don't leave any uh, white space, just keep creating the designs and patterns. I have this darker tone I'm using this tone on the other side now for the moon we can keep it white also but we have to color it white or we can use a very lighter tone of grey in it, just pinch of grey, otherwise we can keep it almost white. We can add just the shades or you can keep it just one single colour, you can keep it the dark colour also. And we let it dry you can also do the outlining work or we can leave it like this also I'll just show you how it will look so this is a very simple acrobatic painting to give it the shades of by using the shades of only gray color and I can guarantee you all will enjoy creating it do try, give it a try and share it on our insta and facebook page you can just tag us and of course don't forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for all the latest updates 
and we have come up with a new channel that is Lux on the Trail. I'll share the link after this video and in the description box. Do subscribe the channel for all the fun, basti. Bye everyone. Take care. Stay happy. Stay safe.